Hey, I have a cool new product to show you. Multi-linen with quote panels. You can do all kind of cool things with these panels. Think of pillows, bags, mini quilts, or even frame some quotes for your wall. In this episode, I'll show you a table runner made from a panel and I designed a frame around the panel to give it that little extra. You could go with some matching yardage or a simple strip piecing. In this case, my helper Gabi Beck framed the table runner with hourglass blocks. For a sophisticated look, we just went with only whites and birch prints from the collection Chill. Hi, my name is Brigitte Heidland from Saint Chic. If you like this video, then subscribe and hit the bell so you get notified each time when I publish a new one. Let's talk a bit about the general tips and tricks to get an hourglass block perfectly pieced. There are several sewing techniques as for example sewing single triangles together. But for this project, when we piece only two different colors together, we can go with a quick hourglass piecing technique. I like to piece my hourglass block slightly larger and trim them later to the perfect size. So here is the quilt math for this project. To the desired size of your finished hourglass unit, add one and a half inch to get the measurements for the squares to cut. Layer a birch and a white square with right sides together and draw a diagonal line from corner to corner on the wrong side of the top square. Stitch a quarter inch away from the drawn line on both sides. Cut the stitched unit diagonally in halves. Press seams towards the birch fabric. You get a half square triangle. Make a bunch of those. Draw a diagonal line perpendicular with the sawn seam on the back side of a half square triangle. With right sides together, they are a marked half square triangle on top of an unmarked half square triangle. Make sure the birch half of one is facing the white half of the other. The seams of the both units nest to make matching the seam much easier. Pin to secure and stitch a quarter of an inch away from the drawn line on both sides. Cut the unit apart on the drawn line. You now have two identical hourglass blocks. Press the seams like a swill. To trim these units to size, find the midpoint of the unfinished block, match the 45 degree mark on the ruler with the diagonal seam line and trim to the desired square size. Now make all the needed units to frame the quote panel. You can even embellish the quilt like Gabi did with some hand-stitched snowflakes. And look how she quilted the border, variegated thread and straight lines on her domestic machine. You can do this too. If you want to make this weekend project to prepare for a beautiful winter decoration for your home, I wrote a quilt pattern for you and you can buy this PDF pattern in my shop. I will link it below. If you liked this video, hit that like button and for more tips and ideas, be sure to subscribe and share it with your friends. You want to see more of the chill fabrics? Don't miss my studio tour where I show you my inspirations on this collection.